the White House wanted help leading the nation's schools into the future, it turned to a Spartanburg County superintendent. WIFF News 4's Mike McCormick with how that visit could change classrooms in our area. The ones that are at the bottom. In Kimberly Alverson's fourth grade classroom at Jesse Boyd Elementary, teaching is high tech. I'm using an app called Number Pieces to teach division. There's a math lesson happening while one group works on language arts and another tackles social studies. Some students work independently. It's the next generation of learning. I feel very fortunate to be here and have that right here. Alverson works for a superintendent who took this example of education right to the top. And I was. You know, just a, a handshake from him. That Spartanburg District 7's Dr. Russell Booker at the White House on Wednesday. It, it was an honor to to be there. Booker got the invitation to be among 110 superintendents to work on the president's plan to get 99% of students nationwide connected to the internet within five years. One of the things I said to the group was, I would love to see South Carolina become the first state uh, where 100% of our school districts. Have signed on to the future ready pledge, and I think we can do that. One of his goals is to get Wi Fi into neighborhoods in the district. There was a very poor district in California, and what they've done to bring access to their community, they get their school buses. All the buses have routers on them, and they park them in neighborhoods at the end of the day. He also wants to see old fashioned textbooks get replaced by interactive digital tech books, something Kimberly Alverson's class already has. Our math textbook is online. More proof as to why Dr. Booker went to Washington. Mike McCormick, WIFF News 4, Spartanburg.